Hi, my name is Georgia, and today I'm going to be telling you about the northern pocket gophers, and the scientific name is Tomomis talpoids. That is a side view, and that is the front view. A northern pocket gopher's habitat and range is that they like to live in good soil in meadows, by streams, in mountains, lowlands, and in crop fields. They also live in tunnels and burrows. And the first level is for the restroom and going to the bathroom. And the second is for living in. The elevation range is from 915 to 3,750 meters. They are most commonly found around 1,220 meters. This is the range map and they can be found as north as Canada, as south as New Mexico, as east as Minnesota, and as west as California. The way of life. Their food habits are that they eat plant material and in this picture they would eat the roots and the grass. They also eat crop stems and herb stems. Their lifespan in captivity is 5 to 6 years and in the wild it's 18 to 24 months. Their reproduction, reproductive habits are that males are allowed in female tunnels to mate and the mating season is in late spring and so their gestation period is 18 to 20 days which is about two and a half to three weeks and they'd have their births in mid-may to mid-june and they both females and males become sexually mature at three to six months their social behavior is that they mainly live on their own in their own tunnels and burrows and they can live up to um, 20 gophers per hectare. Some of their natural predators are badgers, weasels, foxes, bobcats, owls, snakes, and hawks. The description of northern pocket gophers are that their length is 160 meters to 200 and, er, 260 millimeters, sorry, which is about six and a half to ten and a quarter inches. And their size, meaning their mass, is six to 160 grams, which is about two to five and a half ounces which is less than a pound which is still really really tiny their colors are that they can be grayish brown to brown to yellowish brown and in these pictures you can see that they have a range of colors like I said that one is gray and brown and this one is like an orange and brown which is pretty interesting and you see their strong claws they have five of them and they are used to dig a lot they also have external cheek pouches and sharp incisors which helps them bite things very well and the cheek pouches are used to store their food when they're not eating it and they also have rounded ears, loose skin, short limbs. That makes them small. And females are 10% smaller than males. Family comparisons between northern and plains pocket gophers. Some similarities are that they both have the pouch, the external pouches and the sharp incisors. And that, that. The one before that was the northern pocket gopher. This is the plains pocket gopher. They both burrow and tunnel, and those are pictures of both of their, um, both of where they come out of the ground. And they both eat plant roots and plant stems and herb stems too. 
Um, some differences are that the northern pocket gophers, they are a lot um, skinnier and a lot longer than the plains pocket gophers, which are a lot wider and a lot more um, uh, shorter. And they can be the same colors, but they have mostly their, they can be different colors too. This is my works cited page. This is one of my picture cited pages. And that is, this is my last picture cited page. Thank you for watching.